Boom. What's up, money geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we are going to talk about ticket symbol DM desktop metal. So this is a stock that we cover here on the channel. I have been buying this stock uh, from the very get go when they announced they were going to go public through a spark. So I started buying and I told you guys to me, I see this stock as the future of uh, manufacturing or part of manufacturing. So again, today uh, the stock actually came out, their earnings results, and there's still a tremendous amount of opportunity. So that's what I wanted to cover in today's video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So when it comes to desktop metal guys, again, this is a stock that we cover here on the channel. And I told you guys from the very beginning that uh, when I look at the future of manufacturing, um, right now we have a situation where if you want to order a part, let's say from a dealership, the dealership would take your order and then send it to their manufacturing facility, maybe in China, who knows. And then when they manufacture, they ship it to you. So you're looking about a month out or so. But if you have 3D printing machines like what Desktop Meta has right now, where they can actually 3D print that part for you right on site at the dealership, this would be in, I mean, like just crazy. Imagine going to uh, maybe a trade show or something and actually having a prototype of your product right there, which can be easily printed with this. Uh, 3D printers. I think it's good. And even so, if you look at most places where you have to hang on to a lot of inventory, if you have these, these particular machines, then you don't have to buy everything. So you only buy the stuff that you think are your top sellers. And then the stuff that is slow, you can buy this machine and then print them out as people order them. So, I mean, the use cases here are just uh, uh, incredible in my personal opinion. So I love this stock and I continue to buy in. So this stock is actually taking a massive bidding even from when we started talking about it. And I'm going to show you guys here. Um, desktop made as a matter of fact, let's jump over here um, and look at. So this is their, their earnings report, their Q2. So as we can see here, revenue uh, was up 68% for uh, you know second quarter, which is pretty great. Um, one other thing that really stood out to me is the fact that new customer grew new customer acquisition grew 44 percent that's pretty great um they made some other serious uh acquisitions which is why i think that uh the stock has been taking a beating because they're spending all this money and uh diluting their shares by acquiring all these other companies so they acquired this uh, aerosync we talked about it here on the channel acquired beacon uh, bio we talked about that here uh robust liquidity position with cash which is what we understand here and then um, most recently, if we can take a new, the news here, um, they acquire um, uh, uh, X1. So that's another uh, area where they are continuing to uh, spend money to acquire and build that uh, name recognition in the space. The fact that they're going out there and buying all these other companies and establishing themselves, I think to me, it's, it's pretty excellent because um, you take out your competition and what does that make you? It makes you the household name. Everybody is under you, under your name. So I think this is a, a smart idea. Is that good for the stock price right now? No, short term, the stock price has taken a massive bidding. So if we go back here year to date, um, you can see this stock skyrocketed to, um, this is just back in February of 2021. Look at this thing was sitting at $33 and it's plunged down uh, 53, almost 54% sitting right now at just a little bit over $7. I think to me, this is a prime buy stock. If you don't have any position in this stock right now, long-term guys, again, this is a long-term play. You might see a swing opportunity here, but I, I'm encouraging you guys, um, if you want, you have to have long-term plays, not just swing or day trades. Focus on building long-term portfolio. And I show you guys that here on the channel. So this is one of the plays that I, I continue to load up on because this thing is gonna explode in the future. Again, if you look at companies that are disrupting their industry, I think desktop meta is going to be that disruptor in my personal opinion. So keep an eye. Um, again, this is this right here. We can see here this thing 
year to date it if we go back let's just go back one year so you guys can see so this thing it was a spark so it came through a spark so obviously it started at seven uh ten dollars and then that's when i actually started buying this at ten dollars and you see this thing has gone up to 33 and then pull back again this is an area where you load up and continue to hold give this thing three to five years you're going to see some massive explosion so the fact that these guys are going out and acquiring all these other companies and building and establishing themselves as the main player in this space i think it's a smart idea if you understand what kathy wood is doing and in, in investing in disruptive uh, companies desktop matter is obviously uh one of those kind of stocks that she would invest in so that's why i i'm bullish on this stock long term again when i say long term we're looking five years down the road i'm not thinking about uh maybe six months or so six months you might get a swing trade there but i'm holding five ten years down the road because again these are companies that uh, once they get going, things are going to change. They, they are actually disrupting the way we currently do manufacturing, which in my personal opinion, I think is going to really impact um, not just manufacturing, but shipping, logistics and all that stuff. Because instead of shipping a ton of goods from one location to another or parts from one location to another, what do you do? You just buy a machine, put it in, in one location and print the parts from there. And that way you're not like doing a lot of shipping and well, wasting trees with boxes and stuff like that. I just had to put that in there. So again, let me know in the comment section what you think about this. In my personal opinion, I think the levels where desktop media is trading right now under eight dollars, to me, it's a steal. Um, start buying, start loading up on this. And, and don't if you sit there and look and then tomorrow when this thing explodes, you're gonna be like, Oh, I missed out on this one. Again, you should be smart. Do some research so you understand the business model, what these guys are doing before you jump in. Um, that's it for this video, guys. Let me know in the comment section again what you think. If you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, guys, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has their promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get some free stocks at no cost to you. Links in the description. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated.